hello, hello. Here we are again. All right, bitches. Just put my tea down. <laughs> what Tracy made me. He's sweet. Okay. <laughs> hello again, everyone. Here we are. Errol, hi. Kamasaki, hi. hi. Enigmat, Lord, hi. Kane, hi. Dark Wolf, Double Dark hey. Eye. Woo. Yeah, here we are again. Great drink of hi. <laughs> Yeah, it works Michael for Martin. Hardcore Martin. Yeah, it works. <laughs> SBO, hello! Hello, SBO. SBO. And thank you again, again, again for all your hard work. Everyone keeps saying hello when I'm in the trailer. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, here we are again. And, okay, well, first of all, let's start off with the, the news that everybody wants to hear. There's no news this week. <laughs> <laughs> nope, we're Sorry. playing the same stuff again, okay? So the same stuff you're playing, we're playing it again. So you better be you better have lots of cunning questions about all sorts of various subjects that we can talk about. Like what the hell would Michael Bay mode be? Which I hate to <laughs> oh think. Oh god. <laughs> Don't even want to think about it. No no no. Explosions everywhere. And that guy who goes, no 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 no. <laughs> oh God! Yes. So uh, what? Well, yeah. We're loading. Sorry. We're loading a game. Yeah. Awesome news. <laughs> yeah, <sorry>. Yay! <laughs> uh, Still got question time. Exactly. Massacre and question time. That's exactly what it is. Yeah. I know. You had demand. Second week with no news. You wait. It's. <laughs> we got lots more of these weeks to come. Uh, no. uh, will pet slicing be able to cut the trunk off elephants? Thanks, Errol. That's a brilliant one to start us off. Um, and I would say that <laughs> I, I'd imagine it would be. Certainly should be. The possibility to chop appendages off. I'd imagine that a, a trunk would be just like a leg or an arm and would be treated just as viciously. Oh. <laughs> Wow, you look beautiful today. Thank you, Lone Star. <laughs> I've, I've brushed my beard and everything. <laughs> yeah, it's loaded. Uh, uh, oh, uh, Huntingford. No, I can answer that one straight up. No Mac early access. No, that's absolutely true. Um, we did actually always say that the, the Mac version of the game, along with the Linux version of the game, were going to be coming along after the final, the, the final release of the PC version of the game. Um, and so I'm afraid that is the answer to that one. Plain and simple. Ah, oh, that was a good rectum. Ooh. Evil rectum. <laughs> and an that blood, exactly what you say. Um, all work uh, currently going on is on the engine side of things. Uh, oh, you've got a, an annihilator. I've got a, um, yeah. A zapper. Yeah. Zapper, electrical blaster, though. Yeah. yeah. Got me some time. <laughs> Lord Karma, Peds Riding Elephants is an excellent idea. And I think that we should. I've, I've actually ridden an elephant. It's horrible. It's like gripping a coconut between your thighs. <laughs> very, very uncomfortable. Really? Is that what they feel like? What's yeah. The skin? Yeah, the skins. Yeah, really. Hair is, it, it is exactly like a coconut. What? Yeah. Is it hairy? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, I know. You don't really see it, it on, the, on, the, on the nature films. No, yeah, they don't. Um, they got close to me. No. And. Um, and the man driving the elephant was actually uh, telling it what to do by hitting it on the head with a lump hammer, which we were quite shocked and disgusted about. <laughs> and you know, we were kind of you know on the verge of complaining when he dropped the lump hammer, and the elephant picked it up and gave it back to him with his trunk. Oh! So it clearly didn't care. So it didn't mind. <laughs> it, was, it really didn't hurt him. He <laughs> wouldn't give it yeah. back if it did. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I know. There we go. Digressing already. The finer points of coconut cracking with knob and sin. Uh, yeah, surfaces like mud and snow. Will they have? Trent asks. Will they have different types of skid marks instead of leaving black marks? Leave normal maps to make it look like they are. Blah 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 blah. blah. Yes, of course. Yes. Uh, the. I mean, you know, we were able to uh, to rustle up some you know skid marks that had different colours and everything for Carmageddon. So and two, so I would sincerely hope that we'll be able to do the same thing for reincarnation. Yeah, like when you're running new snow. 
Yeah. I'll be driving it all the new snow. Yeah, crunch, crunch, crunch. It's got to have that satisfying... Oh, there's uh, a bit of a party going on. The sound of reindeer bells. Oh, yeah. Party behind the... Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah. They're having a nice time. Having a bit of a party going on here. Yeah. Whacking my doors. Oh, wrong one. <laughs> No, Jim Zilla, that isn't what I meant about the elephant. His spirit hadn't been broken. It hadn't been broken at all. It was a happy elephant. I'm sure. <laughs> That's what I like to think, anyway. Just pushed in with my doors. Uh, Andy, have we been fixing the lighting? Yes, we have. Um, yeah, the lighting, the, the lighting engine um, writing uh, pretty much came to an end, and now it's a case of uh, it all works right, and uh, we just got to get the balancing now right on all the material, um, the, the properties, and the scene lighting itself, uh, which will continue to be tweaked right up until we tell them to bloody well stop because we've got to release the game. <laughs> flappy, flappy, flap. It says bad, Mike. Always giving him a flop in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yes. Oh, there's a person. Oh, did that pet just get my power up? I oh, did it. Uh. Don't know. I don't know what I want the pet back. Uh. So, uh, Grey Frinko, will we get new? Co will you get some new content next week? Um, I would say that the chances of that are extremely slim. Uh, and as we were discussing last week, um, what the emphasis now in update, in terms of updates is performance updates. Uh, we feel that there's enough content in the game now for it to be good fun. Uh, we don't want to give away so much content that there's nothing to excite and that seems new when it comes to the full release. And so I think we're, really much, we're pretty much there now with the amount of new content you'll get. We may decide that one or two things we're going to release. Um, obviously, we still want to get multiplayer out to you uh, prior to the full release um, and that's the next big endeavour uh, Aethan in, in Immortal um, the specs we're playing on are on the website and I'm sure Shane will respond to you with a nice linky or, or even a summary of what they are <laughs> we can never remember. That should so have a sucking noise. Does it have a sucking noise? <laughs> this is the bad thing about playing it. So yeah, that's right. sound. We, can't, we can't hear it at all, so we've got no idea. Uh, I should. Because we also have feeble memories. We can't. Remember yeah, I can't remember it, even though played it <laughs> play earlier it on. Time, yes. <laughs> oh, great drinker. Oh, sorry. Yes. Uh, that's right, yeah, so you will get updates to the content that we've already released uh, as improvements are made to that content, of course, yes. Oh, Ooh, frozen opponents. Smack. That was such a good T-boning. And so, Andy, I've, hopefully I've just answered the same question. Uh, great to great drinker. Uh, yeah, current, current... Um, content is all going to be um, improved and prettified um, as we go on. Oh, I know where something is. Pretty sure. Oh, it might not be on the grace route. Okay, great drinker. We're, we're we're slowly creeping our way towards a full um, a full understanding and answer to what you were asking. So, will you get some new content of that? Will you get some of that update next week? Uh, well, and the the simple answer to that is, I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I really don't know uh, the what the frequency will be of those um, incremental updates to the content that you've already got. Uh, so that's one of the things that should be put in the questions to be asked and for us to answer a section <laughs> of the summary oh. of this week's Twitch. 
Oh, there's object spinner in. Oh. oh I'm things. just gonna. Oh, oh yeah. I'm gonna break things now, but. Oh, there you go. Cool. Sorry, I was just getting our, our view of the game completely obscured. Uh, Jono, pet with stupid heads will be coming back. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. I think I just chopped them. We her could in. not have them. The was it? The object spinner. I don't know. I don't cool. know. Let's have a look. <laughs> see if it's worth it. Worth cool. watching. See, see, see. Yeah, um, I did get her. Oh. What? Oh no! Oh, oh I thought that. Works. Rubbish. It was rubbish. Not what, not what right. I thought I did. So, moving swiftly <laughs> on. so yeah, all the uh, all the scaling of um, heads and car stuff. Oh, actually, well, there is also already some scaling stuff with the uh, stretch gold power, um, which does mean. Oh no, that's right. It's just the body of the car. It's not the actual um, running gear. Um, but at some point, uh, yeah, ped, you know, ped stretching in various directions, um, pups and uh, and ditto cars. Mini cars and, and uh, giant cars, that sort of thing. They'll all be in there. Woo! Uh, Front J3 car splitting, no. Um, that's still not begun work on that yet. Um, the, now, let's see. There has been discussion about stuff that he needs for <laughs> tracked vehicles. That's what. He's, gonna be, he's doing some work on tracked vehicles. Way. Right, twisted mind. Uh, the engine smoke going from light to dark and grey to black was a good indicator of how bad our opponents were damaged in C1. Uh, is it planned to work this way in CR? That's a very good question, actually, because that was uh, my understanding of, of how it should work as well. Um, but I think from that we can summarise that, yeah, at present it just is a bit black and then very black uh, in terms of smoke intensity. Uh, good question. and. A good comment and one that we should actually feed back and say, Oi, it should be working this way. So that's what we will do. Uh, and suicidal pets was your uh, I've Voyanity. Uh, so suicidal peds were actually in Karma 2, so that's going back 15 years or so. Uh, so yeah, you may have had the idea as well. That happens a lot. Mm. People having the same idea because we all have similar <laughs> evil, <you> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> evil <laughs> target <laughs> minds. <laughs> They're running around really fast. <laughs> they, should have, peds. they should have like um, Smurf voices as well. Yeah, <laughs> they do what well, they did in Karma. Little tiny so. height voices. Yeah. That'd be great. Did the... Uh, <laughs> In Karma 2, yeah, they, there was a high pitch voice. I don't know if it was a double pets or miniature pets, but yeah. Oh, that's <laughs> so funny. <laughs> um, Manaquit, are you going to get fantasy levels like hell in Karma 1? Well, the number of levels that are going to be in the game are already set. Uh, they just include kind of classic Karma 1 levels for the time being. Uh, oh, plus um, some new multiplayer arenas. And, uh, and variations on the sort of levels that were in Come On. Um, however, there's no reason why things like the Hell Fantasy Crazy level shouldn't actually. Ooh! Ah, that's interesting. Little, bits, see, little things you see all the time that you didn't even know were in there. <laughs> little shortcut onto the. Uh, well, it's pretty tricky to get onto the monorail track, but. Mm. And he says it all. Hey, DLC, yes, that's right. DLC will have it, everything that we don't put in this game. SBOC, font of all knowledge, of course. T only tiny pets had squeaky voices and skinny ones, but not as much. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Dendro, um, badass intro for the game. <laughs> Is that Not one currently you scheduled? All right, sorry. No, it, it, will there be? A, will there be? Will one? there be a sort of FMV, you know, badass intro? Right, yeah. Um, I would, I wouldn't like to say that uh, we could, uh, that we would necessarily be able to accommodate that within the current um, time scale. That's the thing. 
uh, it may be that we can do one, you know, using in-game footage, um, and it may also be the case that we can commission one of our very good friends um, to do something along those lines for the final game. Uh, so we will probably be talking about doing that. Uh, Jim Ziller, uh, that's an interesting question as well. The um, the plan, the idea of having dual monitors set up so that your map is on the second screen. Ooh. We we did did, did we say did we have that? Well, we said that we'd it'd be cool if we had a companion, didn't we? Oh, That'd that's that's right. Yeah, that's it. Companion. We were yeah, that's right. That was back in the days of again the initial design work when me, Sim, and Dave H, who's uh, the game director on the game now. Uh, when it was just three of us working on it, we were doing the initial design work. Um, yeah, that was something that we were talking about, having a companion app that would be on your iPad that would show you the map. Um, so the second monitor option is this a nice is a really one. Great it's idea. a great idea. Um, and it's one that, we'll, again, we'll, that's a, we'll pass it on. If it, if it could be done, it would be great. Um, we all have two monitors two here. Monitors here yeah. So, it, it, you know, it would be funny if it's not across somebody else's mind. Conviction, hey, hi, welcome. Uh, Lord Karma intro contest. Well, why not? We could, but the problem with an intro contest would be that obviously we'd have a certain quality threshold that we would have to reach in order to be happy with a, an intro video um, that would actually be there in the final game. Um, and so I guess we would it would have to have that caveat. Uh, but yeah, there's no reason why we couldn't you know, run a comp. <laughs> As SPO points out, though, actually, then um, everybody being able to upload their entry to the comp would yeah. be quite interesting. Plus, it adds a, a, quite a large uh, lump of additional data to the uh, the game download itself. Splatting grand is never. Yes. Never. <laughs> it's it fails to me. <laughs> Mighty Sapo, the photographic mode in game um, is uh, something that I would like very much personally to see. Uh, the ability to make your uh, screenshot of the game as as you can in next card game. I think you can do it pretty similarly in BeamNG engine um, as well, uh, where you can actually freak with the, the look of the quality of the game whilst you're in, mm. in a pause mode. Lodestar game gets Steam Achieves, yes. It will. Oh, okay, Kane. Yeah, I, um... Uh, oh, no, sorry. What, whoops, sorry, Twitter mine. Beg, beg your pardon. Uh, the chat's scrolling up and I'm missing who's saying what. Um, right, the, you, you Twitter mine, you've made a thread about um, a race route contest. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it's a nice idea. We'll take a look at that and um, yeah, and you know think about yeah uh, making that an official comp. Yeah, Sims competition lady. It's all it's all up to her really. <laughs> it's not my official title. <laughs> not the competition lady. <laughs> no, no. I know. Just do them as well. <laughs> Someone said um, competition to do a screen as well. I thought that was really good. I think that should be definitely, <laughs> yes. definitely go in there. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, um, get you screaming in the game. Uh, was was that last week? Yeah, yeah, yeah last yeah. week. So I think okay. it was last week. Someone yeah. said it. I thought, yeah, that's a good idea. It is an excellent idea. Have to do the girliest. Yeah, lots of nice comp do. ideas. We we want to keep them going. So yeah. that's, that's great. <laughs> Uh, yeah, RPG Wizard. Um, right. Yeah, whether okay. we, <laughs> funnily enough, we were talking about the other, the other day. Uh, it was mentioned the fact that we have to uh, to kind of beat the QA department in order to make sure that they test the game uh, with keyboard and mouse because it is currently the case that obviously it works so well with the controller that it's nice if, if you've got it to use it. And obviously we have all got them, so we tend to play the game with the controller. Um, things like like operating. Took his front off. 
<laughs> Where are you going anywhere now, Stig? <laughs> Any, anything that works better with analog is always going to work better with analog, um, and that's so when you when you have to have a digital equivalent on a keyboard, uh, it's not going to work as well, and that, that's just unavoidable. Um, but it could be that the actual then the actual. So it's difficult. You can't you can't really cater for for a different input. Um, that the player is making and make something react differently due to that input, I guess. Dentro, uh, will it be possible for modders to mod everything? Heads, maps, yes. Um, that's right, it will be. Pretty much the case that, that you can go in and mess about with almost anything in the game. Um, and. Clearly that's something that's already starting to be demonstrated um, if you go onto the mod section of the forums and take a look. Um, the Obviously the, le the level of user skill involved uh, will rise, you know, depending on what it is that you're actually planning to mod. You know, it's obviously creating a completely new PED is quite difficult with that, well, as, as is car, obviously, with our modelling skills and all, all that, um, but you should be able to pull various data off the internets and play with that and get it into the game. <coughs> and there goes Charm giving you a handy link. And Trent in there with the handy advice as well. Just confirming what I'm saying. <laughs> I've took his arms. And he's ridden up in our arms, look. Oh. <laughs> uh, he is mostly armless. Come on then, run away. Oh, I thought he was going to stand on the... Oh, the supposed pets to be, trigger the he's supposed, He is actually supposed to be running away. He was running away a minute ago. Yeah. He seems to be stuck on the spot now, doesn't he? How <laughs> <laughs> good oh, I hope you guys saw it? that. Oh, he didn't kill him. What? That oh, should have well killed him. <laughs> bloody bad. Here we go. <laughs> Big lump on his head. Where's he gone? It's not in there, is it? No. Just. No. That's not in there, is it? Are you over there? Uh, is he uh, over there? No. Where have you gone, you little Is it? Oh no, he's got arms. No, they got arms. Took off their arms. Bastards managed to get away. Oh, that flickering fire. So annoying. It is in replay when you're trying to get a good screenshot. Mm. And it gets yeah, and you have up. to just like tweak, 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 tweak yeah. the camera to get it so it's not flickering. I'm going to get some more armless pets. Yeah, Ethan Immortal. Well, that's exactly our, um, our philosophy as well. That uh, the more model, moddable a game is, the longer its uh, lifespan and... Uh, the attention that it will receive um, and the better community that you've got because people can play with it and they can share what they've played with with everybody else so absolutely that is the key point well, it's just so hard nothing nothing I do okay fact it's just too hard he is Hella hard at he the is, moment, isn't yeah. he? Yeah, and he, if you are him, you deal with the it's most cool. immense amount yeah. of damage. Yeah, but if you're not, it's very him. nice. But not <laughs> being him means that it takes. It's hard to kill. Ages to kill. Frozen opponents. Yeah, steam up his ass. Right, I'm gonna go and take a run up. Can't have got that far. Where is he? Where is he? Despio <laughs> said, yeah, oh, the fun you can have with a single pet. But that's it. Yeah. You yeah. just get sort of, you know, a little bit sidetracked. found him. Ah. Torturing some poor pet. Great. You'd found him. It just be crushed into it. Oh, sorry, I thought you but, meant the pet with no arms. No, no, no. <laughs> Long lost pet. Oh, there he is again. Yeah. <laughs> oh. It's all right. I'll get that for you. <laughs> that's an interesting that's an interesting one to uh, to look into whether the uh, Casimax just said he swears the AI caddy does more damage 
as opposed to, as opposed to when you're driving it, I assume is what you mean. Um, yeah, that's, that's an interesting one. If anything, the game should be slightly... <laughs> uh, should be slightly balanced so that you do more damage than the AI. Um, but I don't know whether we found we needed to do that this time around. Uh, I think we did it, we did it in the past, but... Um, yeah. Hmm. An interesting question. <laughs> uh, yeah, how called Martin? Um, that's a. I knew you meant opponents. It's okay. Um, the, or the, not the opponents, because uh, I realised that that wasn't what you meant. Um, the opponents will be able to repair their cars, um, and it'll happen uh, if, if, for instance, you know you you've just been in it. So like you've just had a scrap there with um, with Caddy, and you've left him with only two wheels. Uh, he will be able to recover his car a certain amount uh, so that he can get four wheels back if you leave him alone and go off and do other things um, so if you leave a you know a partially crippled opponent uh, they, they can help keep the game entertaining um, by as I say if left alone for us for some time um, repairing some of their damage it's something we wanted to do in order to make the game a little bit more um, closely related from single player to multiplayer, so that the single player game plays more like the multiplayer game should, or will, or does, in fact. <laughs> Skynet, node one, I like that idea. Uh, <laughs> A special call out for when the Annihilator eats somebody. Oh, <laughs> yes, I just went caddy in one hit. <laughs> Pelvic thrust is your favourite. I, I hit him right on the edge of his... You should replay that. Yeah. Let's see that. Let's see that again. Well, hey, like a Rooney. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> right, quick, report it. <laughs> it was good, it was good. Yeah. Look, he's going downhill now. Polly's it's all downhill from here. here. <laughs> 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 you it's a terrible witty. joke. <laughs> oh, dear. <sighs> ah, right. Uh, <laughs> oh, Reincarnation 2. It's going to be called Come Again Reincarnation, Reincarnation. <laughs> um, and would it be the same, right, okay, would it be the same engine, but with only levels cast from Karma 2? I think it's more likely that we would plan, you know, we would love this game to have a very long tail, as they call it in biz, um, and that we do all that sort of stuff as DLC for Come Again Reincarnation. And Come Again Reincarnation really does sit there as the font of all retro kind of content updated um, and then and then, then our, our next major Carmageddon title will be um, the next oh. major title all fresh cool. uh, from when I got in from the front in it oh yeah <laughs> he ain't got no front end oh. pelvic thrust him against the rocks no. <laughs> oh, insta kill. I got straight out of the screen there, yeah. And I that must have insta killed myself. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Are you uh, Shane? I'm, I'm Shane. Uh, impaling Tomeister's hook, Skynet. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's. that's Someone true. pick me a car. Pick me a car. I'm going to pick a uh, Yeah, Skynet hooks and. Uh, spikes and chompers should all do appropriate star damage to beds uh, once Patrick's been chained to his desk and made to write that code. Mm. <laughs> yeah, Enigma Blood, do a valve, go episode, episodic release two mini games cool. and then never release the next big one. I'll be the boss worker. That's what I like that idea. But where's the next Half-Life coin? Where's it gone? <laughs> uh, 
Uh, RPG Wizard, Cleaver, be rebalanced. Um, yeah, the cars, the er, the very early cars, I think it really, to a certain extent, it's the same with the Eagle, um, have, have suffered a little neglect as in you know the thrust to get other cars in. Uh, so, well, we just have to wait, and um, those cars will be revisited with a view to getting them uh, balanced and having their own you know, special reason if you want to, to use them. It'll happen. And of course, it will have Hellhound as well, so you'll have. Oh, if you've sorry, got SPO. Them. I'll be bear next. <laughs> oh, SPO. I did, I, I did do that on purpose. I'll, I'll be a bear next for you. Promise. <laughs> oh, Twisted Mind, sorry. You, 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 I think put this before the road linking the beach to the lighthouse. Um, a road linking the beach to the lighthouse because it's irrelevant to go there and come back. Uh, yeah, I suppose it's irrelevant. It may be irrelevant at the moment with the way things are currently laid out in terms of power ups and everything. Um, I don't know that there's going to be a lot more major level work done in terms of adding additional roads and shit into the geometry. Um, we can we can mention it. I'm happy to mention it for you, uh, but I've, I've got no problem. Oh, I've got no problem with the occasional um, road. To <laughs> it just rolled in, into a like, power up. <laughs> Because they're like the song by Talking Heads. Oh, leave me alone. I heard little bleeps then as if there was a timer counting down. I thought, oh, we're running out of time, but it wasn't. I've no idea what that was. Oh, little bleeping thing somewhere in the office. Can't get to it. Surgery, hi! Yes! Yeah. Skills! Um, Grave Drinker, I was just saying that Cleaver's going to just be made. Just, we could just need to oh, do something to make, make it a bit more entertaining. We ever put them up there, rubbish. Stick up some cool S power ups up there. Yeah. I just was so skilled in getting up there, and all I was rewarded with was time. I can get killed pets for that. Bloody hell. Could have given me a solid granite. I know. I saw it. I saw it. Yeah. Well, Poets once the, the design department give us a tutorial on how to actually place the power-ups at the levels, um, we'll be able to do it all ourselves. I think I'm going the wrong way around the track now, aren't I? That's, well, that's almost obligatory, though. Quite possible. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Hmm? I just went up this hill. Oh, there's one. Yo, your lord. Hi. How are you doing, man? Tipsy too. Uh, what did you say? Uh, oh, a team versus um, a team vs team, where each team can have one car of each weight class. Mm. Might be cool for multiplayer. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Team play is something that we really, 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 really do want to see. Yeah, kind of like um, I think we've discussed this before, but I think there was a, I can't remember what game mode it was called now, but where you get to pick a few cars and then once your car dies, you you respawn as the next car and you have so it's like they're like life so you know what I mean? Oh okay, okay. That's um I think that that was definitely a fighting game. Whoa. Oh yeah, that's um the Counter Strike uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, thingy, yeah. Yeah. Plays it'd be, like that. It'd be quite yeah, fun. where every time you every time you get every time you get a kill, you get to get you get the next weapon, sort of thing, which is quite nice. Oh, yeah. And if you get killed, you get to pick the next one. Hmm. You, well, you get to do the next one. Uh, yeah. Our banana and pinball mode. The last bit of pinball mode. All right, Surgery asks, um, oh, when is Karma 2 coming to Steam? Well, obviously, uh, we'd love to bring it to Steam, but uh, whether or not that's going to happen, I really couldn't say. There you go. Love this place. Power up galore. <laughs> X Timmy's idea um, of a Siamese game mode for multiplayer. One person does the steering and the other does the throw. <laughs> yeah. That I love, yeah. <laughs> That'd be funny. <laughs> Much funnier in a real car though. Yeah. <laughs> uh, excellent. Oh the power ups. I think everybody died from the power. Right. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's 
tend to be quite decimating, doesn't it? I have a banana. <laughs> I saw a question there that I thought was quite interesting. Um, yeah, gameplay, extra gameplay modes, yeah, extra game modes are kind of a DLC thing. But we do like to see these things discussed in forums and uh, you know, get your ideas and get them on the list of uh, wish list for game types. Yeah, Z sorting as a recorded business of uh, smoke versus lights versus transparency stuff. Uh, not looking right it is a bug that needs working out, sorting out. Uh, that's that's another another good point uh, that we should uh, have raised is some um, manic sweets manic sweets sorry post tea belching going on um, the objects in the distance fade in rather than just bing, popping up there are a lot of other games out there where the distance objects fade in Fallout Three being one that immediately jumps to mind. Um, I did it very elegantly and uh, and it works well so we should raise that one whether or not we we've got the technology I don't know hey check death hey no idea where I am oh, <laughs> oh yeah oh yeah the helipop Thank you. Sorry, um, mate, I'm um, being made gesticulated at by Tracy with, which is the, which is not time out, and we should stop Twitch uh, so that we can get ourselves sponged down or anything. But whether I would like tea, so I said yes. Bless her. Wasted We all look forward to seeing Diana in game. And you. Wasting the public thoughts oh, to me. Honestly. Cut is just. Cut a yakun. I'll get you all a tea. Don't worry. <laughs> Turnips. Yes, Mr. Lurid, uh, the mod highlights is something that oh. is a really great idea, and, and actually something that um, we were we were hoping to um, showcase for you very soon. Um, I know that uh, Errol's um, been working on his um, flummery mod modders tool. Um, we've been helping him out with just a couple of tiny little things that he was trying to sort out. Um, he's pretty much doing it all himself and we wanted to actually spend some time during a um, Twitch actually uh, showing you, you know, showing you that just to just to get it out there so that everyone's aware of it and uh, and everyone's got, you know, able to start playing with it. So as soon as Mr. Errol uh, feels that he's ready to have it actually presented to the world via the wonders of Twitch, um, then we can, you know, do a bit of a stream on it, so to speak. Twisted mind, your our discussion about trees being too stiff. Um, yeah, basically, uh, I I'm still of the opinion that um, pretty much any car hit, even even a juggernaut hitting a tree, unless yeah. the tree is quite spindly normally comes out worse and the tree doesn't move very much yeah uh, for trees to move and it was generally the case in car in karma earlier comes if you take off and hit the top of a tree so that you've got the leverage going on you will have much more of a chance of turn of putting a tree down obviously we will try tweaking it so it's, so it's fun um, and in vehicles like the plow you're gonna have more chance of actually bending a tree somewhat um, but that's the sort of thing that's just not been balanced and tweaked yet. But we will be looking at it. We will. Promise. Uh, 
Yeah, yeah the AI I do get the AI I get um, power ups. Uh, wow, what a mess! He's basically lost. Oh, he's back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, did that happen? Well, no idea, that's, it must have been in that pinball that's mode. That's horrible. <laughs> what a fucking mess. That's brilliant. <laughs> nice. Nice. Um, damn it. I want that. Yeah, sorry, yeah, so um, AI get power ups. Every power up that's uh, that's not a, um, a triggerable one. So the ones you have to actually use um, by pressing of the little key, uh, the little button. Um, so whether or not they will actually also be able to pick up those pups and trigger them at you uh, is something that has yet to be resolved. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. Caddy Slim Cat, exactly. An egg McLeod. Is um, coming in, coming to Xbox One. I could not possibly say. It's the usual official line on these things. Uh, fueling the fire. Um, the you know the ambience, uh, the ambient stuff, as you call it, the sort of stuff in the environment, uh, inspired by uh, or um, you know, featuring Kickstarter backers. Uh, has yet to be actually included, put into the game. Um, that stuff that is uh, is going to be coming later on. That may well be one of those things that happens in one of our, if you like, soft soft updates to coin a phrase um, to the content that you have now prior to pre-release, where uh, there are some updates to the content that we've already released. Ah, uh -huh, yeah, Kazimak. That's right. So, um, AI using solid granite. Um, good question. Not sure. Not aware of it personally. But then again, yeah, it's quite hard. It, it would be quite hard to tell, I suppose. Unless you were hit by the shooter. Uh -huh. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Spazzed wrecked you. Oh, and you weed yourself. And I weed. <laughs> oh dear, I don't want to get that looked at. Uh, manic wheat, will drugs pup make a comeback? I don't actually know. So many things I don't know about my own game, it's so exciting. I, I like it to be a delicious mystery like it is for you, like. <laughs> Whoa, oh, that was not so good. quite. What the? Oh, <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> That's funny because we couldn't actually see that slow there, but it was just sort of taking off. That was so sweet. Oh, that's good, <laughs> yes. That's very dead. Oh, and you busted it up. Kind of busted some ice, ice cubes, yeah. <laughs> oh. it is, it? No, just head on to oh, the see Andy. Oh, okay, Andy. Bye. Cool zone. Uh, front J3, I do drive a Merc, and the Range Rover driver was Patrick. Um, however, he, it was so troublesome that he got rid of it, and he got a Mercedes, <laughs> which has been so troublesome, he's getting rid of that too. Oh dear. Gonna be the bear. Someone pick a level for me. Cause. Uh, oh yeah, you gotta be. Gotta be bear for SPO. Yeah, SPO wanted the bear. Come on, level. Slip root, slip root. <laughs> I d we can't hear what White any house. we can't hear any of the sound effects in the games when we're when we're playing for you. So I don't know where. Black my lights out as it is. Epic fail is gone. Oh. Ooh. 
sticking to the thing now. <laughs> Do you want to get you a blanket or something? No. Yeah, so. Is that getting that sweaty some, in here? So look at spray. <laughs> the back of your legs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the cursor hand is too dry. It does. It will bleed drop blood. That was one of the <laughs> early stipulations for the front end from Patrick. Oh, did, oh, you've already got, done yeah. it. Well, Sorry. There go. Lighthouse. Woo. Hey, we we are here to please you. <laughs> Beaver Woods. Chill out. Five, four, <laughs> three, two, one. That was spatula. Spatula. Oh. <laughs> nice. Flag man yeah. is mine. Oh. Yeah. Boff. Flag man is mine. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Ouch. Okay. RPG with The audio engine currently seems to emphasize very loud crashes with the mode. So I guess louder, the harder the car would smash it into something. It can get pretty loud. Uh, maybe we could put a max volume limit to be a bit lower than it currently is. Yep, well, that's something that um, will, I've no doubt, come as the audio engine work gets close to completion. Uh, that is still ongoing. Um, so, all oh, thank you. Thank you. Not only has Tracy brought tea, but one of the wine guns. Oh. Hi, Tracy. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, courtesy of John. Thanks, John. John Cook. Oh. John Cook. Was that John Cook? Yeah. Oh, no. John. John. Oh, other John. Thank you, other John. Thank you, other John. John. <laughs> John. <laughs> John Connors. John Connor. Yes. That's the one. <laughs> John Connors from Terminator. Wait, that was. There you go. Introduced Douglas's. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. I like the wine gums. They're a perfect stream commentary. Eating material, they really are. <laughs> Let's chew on these so we can't answer your questions. Crazy's laughing evilly, <laughs> and I've got wine gums stuck in my teeth. Alright, thank you. I have got some. No, I'm here. fine, thanks. Smurfs are pretty good. Well, I don't know one because they're great. Mm. I like Smurfs as well. Harry Bolt Smurfs. Mm. Barry Holes. Yeah. Springy suspension pyro, pyro's nipe. Here's something. Sorry, you're going to be hearing all the squeaky noises of chewing wine gum. Mm -hmm. um, that is something that we would continue to look at. I think some of the suspension ah. needs loosening up somewhat. And on the forums, uh, so this was being discussed, and um, someone, and I've, um, I apologise for forgetting who it is for the momentarily, um, actually gave me the settings for, <laughs> yep, running out of things to say, great drink, uh, for a nicely bouncy fat, fat cat, um, which I then duly popped into my data. Uh, and got myself a nice bouncy suspension fat cat, which felt very nice. Yank, you know, yank tank um, with stupidly inefficient suspension. And um, and it, it, it did actually make me think. Actually, we should we should be doing a little bit more of this um, where appropriate to get a bit of spring in the cars. Um, we have been setting it. I think there's a there's a the level of paranoia about the idea of car wheels cu cutting up through the bodywork, um, but on the fat cat, as it was set, as as was demonstrated by this setup, um, you'd, you still didn't get much cut cut up through the through the um, wings of the cars with the wheels. So I jolly well think we should do a bit more of it. And there you go. That's my long-winded answer. Jolly good. Yes. Whilst um, getting rid of bits of wine gum in my teeth. Uh, what do you think this is, surgery? That is yeah, bloody wine gum. Wine gum Douglas has got a wine gum. Douglas has got it hard at the moment. He's having a sneaky suck on it every time you're not looking. And the wine gum. <laughs> I'm 
quite hard at the moment, isn't he, isn't he Nubby? Huh? He's got it hard at the moment, Douglas. At the he, moment. Has. he has. Douglas has now got extra mouths to feed. Yeah. Due to the recent arrival um, of Mrs. Douglas's um, latest pop outs in the form of the baby Douglas family. Look at them. <laughs> Look. Look at their little faces. There. See? Anyone would think these might have come out of a kinder egg today that Sim bought for 25p, but it's not true. They're actually Douglas Offspring. Douglas Offspring. And what we want you to do is name Douglas's Offspring, okay? And we'll pick the one we like the most. Name them. Honestly, they are the most beautiful things I've ever seen in my life. And I almost <laughs> wept, almost wept with joy when they fell out of the kinder. I mean, that fell out of Mrs. Douglas. So... And they actually, they actually, they fit together in a loving together, way, in an embracing kind of way. That, 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 that. That's so cute. Oh my god! There you see, yeah. So yeah. <laughs> they look tasty, you bastard, game. Smugglers. <laughs> smugglers. <laughs> Snugglers. Yeah, Douglas is smugglers. Snugglers. <laughs> I can't even speak. I'm so overcome Who's with emo mom? emotion. Mrs. Douglas. Mrs. Douglas. She's not. Hold on. She's, um, she's Douglas camera will shy. go off and get her. Yeah, no, I think she's Is she she's right? got over. Yeah, she's over the birth now. I think she's, she's over the birth. Yeah, Douglas will just go and get her. Hold on. Oh, hello. Douglas is. This is Douglas. Wife. There she is. Mrs. She, Douglas, a rare appearance. She's called Betty. Yeah, Betty. <laughs> Betty, right? Okay. Yes. Douglas's missus is called Betty. Betty. Ooh, Betty. Oh, Betty. So, Mum. And, uh, oh, she better. Adam and Arthur. <laughs> so it's feeding. God, we're losing her, aren't we? It's feeding time. She's, uh, she's she going to go back to after him now, and Douglas will come Douglas back. Douglas will return. Plus, he's missing his wine gun. <laughs> he keeps nibbling at I don't even know what I'm doing anymore in here. I'm just driving around senselessly and laughing. Yeah. Sorry, Brett. Okay, I'll go back to the game. Oh, that's all right, Douglas. Yeah, okay. He can't handle the babysitting. That's why he tends to stay here. Leaves her to it. <laughs> can't <laughs> handle the kids. Alpha and Gamma. Alpha and Omega. The bombs from beneath the Planet of the Apes. <laughs> Sibian <Simeon> Doctor. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, it's terrible. It's a terrible job for SBO. This he's got a trinket. SBO who suggested trinket and ple, ple, plethy or pee, 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 pee. Okay. <laughs> trinket. Right. There's a punishment for that. SBO, you've got to get down everybody's suggestions. <laughs> Look, he's doing splits. <laughs> oh yeah. Ew. <laughs> Beaver and Bleak. Oh, that's, yeah, what's we named? Uh, oh, I've got to get me. I just noticed a spoon was still in my tea. That'll be sucking all the heat out of it. Oh, I wonder if they're running that thing yet, which captures all the, um, all the text. All the text, the yeah. That we're not. Are we, Shane? No, we're not. No, don't, damn it. What we will do at some point is run one of those things that actually captures all the text from the uh, the stream that we can then use in evidence if we need to. I mean, uh, refer back to when we're looking at your brilliant ideas. <laughs> right twisted mind. Uh, okay, so you notice the old uh, AI can't get somewhere and just drives at full throttle endlessly against a rock somewhere. Bug, did you? No, no, it's a feature. We fully intended that to be the way they behave. Uh, that is a, is a bug, and yeah, we will fix what the fuck are you doing to them? Go ahead, listen. <laughs> giving, getting their heads. Off with their heads. <laughs> oh, their heads were actually offering other things. A head took out a power up. <laughs> it's quite oh, fun going around getting the great, town. Yeah, I'm gonna head make this a headless town. Maxine, hi! 
Hi, Maxie. You missed the birth of Douglas's offspring. Hey, offsprings, yeah. Ah, uh, never mind. Oh, I need some power-ups. Power-ups. <coughs> to kill Caddy with, because uh -huh. he ain't going to give up easy. Oh, whoa. Whoa, 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 what happened there? That. Is that what I've got to shout? Decapitation! <laughs> oh. Uh, Mr. Lurid, if it, it, it. Yeah, if you don't get uh, points when killing pets with certain power ups, it's a bug. Most definitely. Oh, surgery, did you have to go? It's so. See you, mate. It's alright. Bye. See ya. Uh, yeah, uh, what, to whatever you said. Um, if you didn't quite understand, it, uh, it was yes, it would be fixed. Yeah, yeah, oh, sorry, yeah, when I rambled on just now about the cops, I guess, just pressing themselves up against rocks and stuff, trying to get back to their starting point. Uh, yeah, uh, that'll be fixed. It's. Possibly not a bug, just not bit quite written yet. I've got nothing that'll help me. Point three, maybe. Um, RPG Wizard, that weird thing you saw happen with the fence parts uh, isn't so weird or, or unusual. Um, ma mad physics interactions <laughs> happening uh, is a it's pretty much a feature of um, of physics of games that what have phys physics in them. Um, and you'll find that it happens in all of them. Um, some more noticeable than others, depending on velocities of things hitting each other and stuff. Uh, we've we've always seen it happen on occasion. Uh, it's oh, nothing. Yeah. It's something that will never get fully ironed out. What's that? Oh, it, I didn't realise he was up the bomb. <laughs> I was just like, well, rocking backwards and forwards. What's going on? <laughs> and no, exactly. Well, that's. I'm glad you like it because no, as I say, it'll never get fixed. Oh no, no, no. It's, uh... It is indeed a feature. And isn't it nice to be able to defy the law of physics in a board game? Oh, I've already killed one. Can't kill, <laughs> can't even get an impact with Cutter. I seem to use him as a ramp. Yes, Ethan Immortal, you can quote me. Games, what have physics, have physics happen. Look, I keep That's using cutter as a ramp. Yeah. Say, yeah. It just like goes wee! <laughs> yeah. but it's even worse as he's got no nose left. Can't even get it. I couldn't get an impact with him. That's so always just... been a slightly irritating um, oh. feature of those four and fours, though, as well, isn't it? That you tend to ride over the top of people. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> need to do more damage when you're actually landing on them, I think that's probably something that we should take a look at. Make a note of that. My enjoyment. Just, just, just like a right good punching. No. Punch. Good, good. I feel like I'm Bloody trying to punch someone punch. with yeah. hands. Yeah. <laughs> and just, whoop. But I think, yeah, with, with the bear and um, and screwy, you know, you want to you want to do a lot of damage. They should be heavy. You should do a lot of damage when you actually land on stuff as well. Yeah. So yeah. even if you are riding up onto them, you're it's <laughs> crushing a bit. Yeah. Yeah, I bet that's probably intended. Yeah. Uh, SBO, what I what I just said then was what I said. Get uh, get that down. <laughs> uh, was the car these cars that tend to ride up over other cars like the bear, um, twister, um, really ought to do more damage as they land on top of the car that they're riding over the top of. That's what I said. It would really be nice to do the damage. Uh, Wells, good name. Um, the mini with the spears trapped to the side of it was in the splat pack. I was 
driven by Mike O'Kane, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Mike O'Kane. <laughs> yeah. That sounds like you're saying Mike O'Kane. Yeah. As well yeah. as Mike O'Kane. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so many, so many puns in there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Nick McLeod, I'm afraid you're a bit, uh, you're kind of late with um, Solid Granite Grannies because uh, Solid Granite Peds is one that we have wanted all the way through. Uh, it's also yeah. been mentioned here by uh, by the fans. Uh, the specific Solid Granite Grannies, though, has got a nice ring to it. Solid Granite Grannies. Yeah. I like it. I've given up trying to grab them. See you, Jono. Thanks for dropping See you, by. Jono. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, tossing. Let's try to get one on my bonnet. <laughs> yeah! Oh, nice. <laughs> oh dear, we made a funny game. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I like the leg coming over, that was fun. Oh yeah, big lady. <clears throat> and Sim and Lobby spent the next hour just <laughs> sitting laughing at the game they were playing. <laughs> it's like they've got on a trampoline or something, isn't it? And they go right into the air. This uh, is well pretty, good. Yeah. <laughs> Reminds me of the only time I ever used one of those mini trampoline things. They call them, what, a trampette or something? <laughs> is that, yeah, trampette? Yeah, I think That's it was called funny. a trampette. I know it sounds like a sort of, like a, a young tramp, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Young female tramp, trampette. <laughs> That's quite a lot on, like of loads on telly these days. Uh, <laughs> oh look, yeah, another trampette. <laughs> I like that. But I digress from my digressing story, um, which was, yeah, I'd, so I only ever used one of those once, I was at middle school, and we had to jump on one and go over, it, over the horse. <laughs> And I uh, hit it, and I had no idea how springy they were. And I went over the horse, and I didn't even touch the horse. Nor did I touch the crash mat, the <laughs> other side of the horse. But I actually landed on the gym floor. <laughs> Beyond it all. Yeah, in that yeah, family guy, dead person kind of pose. <laughs> <laughs> Much to the merriment of everyone. And <laughs> yeah. Yes, I was doing that for a long time afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> I did not say I've only used a tramp once. Because <laughs> it's been um, used one more than once. Whee! <laughs> oh, you got so a new favourite thing. <laughs> it's highly amusing. <laughs> oh, Mr. Power. Oh, opponent repulsification, yes! I've got two, three. Uh, I've got three. Do them. Do Wait, the whole the... fucking village. Ah, oh, rectum. Oh, yes. I wasn't close enough to the guys. Come here. Unsc unscrew is right behind me. Uh, oh, good day. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> look at Simon. Oh, oh, look at it. And again, it's all downhill from here. <laughs> <laughs> that's your joke, that's, that that's is. That's a new joke, that. <laughs> If it's rolling, it's all down. Oh, look, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. I think you need to lie down. Oh, uh, great. Where's. I've got no repulsifications left. Nora is, though. Around here somewhere. How would, how would a Harry Kiri power up work? Scene. Well done then for your game, making a game that wasn't funny. That's brilliant. <laughs> Tipsy too. That's very kind of you. We, we, you know, we like to think that the car we had in cars were memorable. So that's very nice to hear. Thank you. Mm. 
Yeah, RPG Wizard. I think we discussed this. Colleen Trump. <laughs> uh, right. Trump Colleen. <laughs> uh, Colleen's my wife's name. <laughs> I'll tell her that when I go. Um, yeah, RPG Wizard. Sorry, uh, I interrupted myself once again. Um, <laughs> the, the toughness of the little cunt is something that does need to be sorted out. Uh, we've said this, it's meant to be the case that it should be quite, quite an easy kill as it is now. You can just punt it around forever and it die. And die. So, yeah, we need to do that. Please be the pelvic first. Or a repulsive kick. <gasps> Pet tumbler. Repulsive no. kick is around here somewhere. Suicidal tumbling pets. Uh, oh, right, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to get uh, around so to the race yeah. <laughs> 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 Maxine. Uh, Maxine. Maxine. Oh. Believe me, the giant inflatable cock. Pet power is, is bound to happen. Is that a secret tunnel? Oh. No, it's just a... It looks like a secret tunnel. Yeah, a differently textured rock that looks like it should smash and let you go in somewhere. Ah, uh, it does look like a secret. Let's make it happen. Oh. A secret place. Oh, it's probably because there's a bridge over the top. Ooh, come so. look at my secret place. <laughs> secret <laughs> place. Oh, okay. It seems dodgy. It does. <laughs> okay, so with the Harry Kiri power up, cool zone says uh, the pets would perform seppuku stomach cutting on themselves so they would die almost instantly so the kill count would increase considerably oh uh, yeah I'm not sure if pets if you do actually register the fact that pets were kneeling down and then sticking a sword into their stomach and cutting their own guts out when you whilst you're driving really around yeah I'm so, gonna, really I'm gonna be um, so yeah it's an interesting idea and uh, we'll take note of it. Oh, yeah. Perfect replacement. Broaderizer! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I just got oh, him against the bridge. Oh. That was good. Can I see that again? Yeah. Oh, good. And I only saw it out of the corner of my ear. You should be able to see it. Oh, I didn't oh. see that! <laughs> That's rubbish. Different camera, different camera. Oh, yeah, hang on. <laughs> I'm playing forward now. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I am. Mean. Oh. Yes. Oh. <laughs> that nice. was good. Nice. I'm going to listen it from this one, wouldn't I? Oh, yeah. Controlled on this now, it's not letting me. Actually, if the cows pulled the swords out and did the disemboweling, that would be that would be better. Yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I've got one more repulsification. One more guy left to get. Even more stupid pointless stuff is needed, Maxine. Absolutely right. You can never have too much stupid cow poop. Stuff. Definitely cow, cow poop cow time is fine. Yep. Yeah. They've uh, definitely got a poop. And we still haven't. Yeah, we still haven't got the uh, cow pooing itself in panic, uh, which is um, panic poop, defecation. Yeah, panic defecation. That's right. It's something that uh, should be uh, able to to be invoked in all all living creatures in the game. <laughs> Dendro, they weren't shitting blood, that was just... Oh, that was oh, just Polly. <laughs> so, nothing to see here, drive along. Um, yeah, the uh, it was supposed to be the cows were pooing themselves, not that they were shitting blood. So. Oh. <laughs> it's a fine. Gone the wrong way. <laughs> wow. Oh, oh uh, Twisted Mind, what's that? I do you know, I actually haven't opened the map up. What was that? Are they doing? Were they doing something? If, if the map is broken, then we should. You should get a hotfix that will fix that. Yeah. What was yeah. that? 
Just a couple looking rather dodgy on the beach. Uh, well, oh. I'm sure I'm convinced yeah. when I was driving over to the. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> he got uh, oh. logged in the face. Yeah. But, well, oh no, that was it. As I was coming over, one guy was like that, and I swear a guy was stood behind him. Oh. Just looked dodgy. Well, that's Did that things, yeah, fling just off. flew, yeah. Like pieces of tree, too. Just random bits of wood. <laughs> I've got it here. Um, I'm get him right in the middle of all these. You see, that's the sort of attention to detail that we always strive for. Uh, Twisted Mind's point that driving, when you drive through the township, you will end up getting a... Um, oh, skid marks. Yeah, skid marks. <laughs> Actual <laughs> skid marks. Yes, proper skid marks, absolutely. What about shitting and vomiting at the same time, asks Diana. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> that will be nice. Uh, Marauderizer, when you say you have dreams of trying to recreate the metal screeching sounds, do you mean in real life? Um, because obviously that's what what we did uh, was we basically went outside of Patrick's and bashed various cars with shovels and stuff. Can we inspect these again? No, really want to be able to inspect them. Yeah, look at Valhalla. She's like not recognisable anymore. Yeah. Ooh, corpses should float in the water. Yeah, that'd be fun. Yeah, we've had we have a. Uh, We've got a um, and changing to skeletons in the acid. Yeah, <laughs> oh. yeah, we've oh, that, that was that is yeah, it's on that stretch goal list. Stretchy goals. <laughs> um, but the uh, yeah, the float floating. Oh. oh, hey! First crash. Floating things uh, is already there. We have um, Bleak City Aardvark. It's called. It's a <laughs> tiny little. Um, tiny little testing level uh, that's just used for testing shit, um, and that's got a big, like a sort of swimming pool thing in it, uh, with, with various yachts bobbing around on it, uh, and that was in there some time ago. So the various things bobbing around code is done. Um, it just needs artists to populate levels, but also, good point, um, the corpses to bob on the water as well. They really need to do that. And sort of, sort of pile up on the shore as the tide comes in. Mm. Or go out. Might be towy. I've been towy in a while. Whether or not, Darjanator, we will then get round to them after you've been driving around for a while. Corpses bloating, <laughs> <laughs> bloating and then exploding. <laughs> be nice. A sort of accelerated, yeah, putrefaction would be great. Probably not for this game. Bridge but of we Put it in the list of things we want to do for the next. Oh. <laughs> uh, shark heads. Shark nado heads. heads. <laughs> or shark that things heads. That film is terrible. <laughs> no, not seen. It's terribly funny, but yeah, terrible, terrible, terrible. Yeah. yeah. Terrible. Head minds. But they have hats on that looks like a mine. <laughs> I like it. That would be brilliant. Yeah. Uh, Twisted Mind, you asking, do we will be able to revert visual options to default settings? Why are they? Well, they're not. I don't understand. Can they not be now? I don't get what you're saying. Um, yeah, Minge Potato, great name. <laughs> uh, uh, at the moment, heads do. <laughs> anyway, there'll be a pause while we laugh at your name. <laughs> it's brilliant. Uh, uh, yeah, we sh heads at the moment do have a tendency to all just be inclined to explode. <laughs> and, uh, I was crying. <laughs> Um, we are in the process of tweaking the settings, and it will be the case that once they, <laughs> that they, uh, the settings haven't been tweaked. Um, oh, I need to restart the event. Much, yeah. Still, put me off. <laughs> Excellent. Five, four, three, two, 
<laughs> Heads will do various things. They won't just explode at the moment. They just they just explode because the code to make them do all the various things that we want them to do when you have impacts with them uh, has yet to be completed. <laughs> oh, I made a bit. I didn't mean to do that. I have trouble explaining to people why I'm called Nobby. Well, it, well it, or not explaining to them why I'm called. Quite what you do with minge potato. Like, <laughs> 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 and look, Douglas is laughing so hard he's completely fallen off the sofa. Dude, we just <laughs> do my little piggy snort then. I hate that. I hate that doing that. <laughs> I've nicked his wine gun. <sighs> <laughs> Good. <laughs> <laughs> Sharks dressed as kittens. <laughs> Pregnant pigs. Tipsy too. Ah! Oh, hey. Ooh. Hey. Secret, secret, secret compartment bit. bit. Everyone's falling oh, in secret Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh. <laughs> I got out of mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pinball. Oh. Oh. oh pinball. Oh, should I shit at mine? <laughs> yeah, go. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, oh, do you oh. not see him coming? He's going to there. He's going to get me. <laughs> Whoa. Did he, did he <laughs> get in the air? <laughs> Can't tell what's going on anymore. Oh, God, that's brilliant. Oh, falling in the water. <laughs> it, it's interesting because it used to be the case that when, if you recovered when, you, when pinball was going on, you'd land and you'd land soft enough that you could actually just That'd not stay pinball. there. Oh, that was oh. good. <laughs> uh, but these Look days, who's trying to get it up there. doesn't seem to be the case anymore. And I'm not sure which, which oh, I prefer. Oh, he's going to make it. He's going to oh, make it. Like it. He is now. Oh, oh no. He's going to push me in. <laughs> Bloody mayhem on this bridge. I like this bridge. Yeah. <laughs> I got caddy then, didn't I? <laughs> sweet, sweet mind shitting. I'm gonna shit some more. <laughs> oh, that one. No, you're right. You weren't driving fast enough to get away from it because of the slope you're on. Shit goes down there. <laughs> pelvic thrustings. <gasps> Two pelvic thrustings. The thrust of pelv. Oh, uh, sorry, we were, we got distracted. I've not been taking any notes of the conversation. Uh, twist in mind, the the idea that electric blue has a special effect on heads uh, that makes them look like they're being electrified and blackened and all the rest of it. We want to do all that. Uh, it's a question of whether we have time to do all that. Uh, but yeah, it's certainly in the plan that all that shit will be done. <clears throat> all these attention to detail, um, polished tweaks will come right at a bloody end. Hopefully. This seems to have good power up placement. Uh huh. Good variety. Oh, you don't you dare get that. <laughs> it's a pelvic thrust to beat him to it then. <laughs> nice. Uh, the up the bum. Uh, up. Oh, okay. <laughs> See ya. Oh. Is that a pad just stood there doing anything? Oh, I wanted a pelvic thrust to pad. Got four, so. Mm -hmm. um, do timed power ups <gasps> stack? Uh, oh, I don't know, actually. Oh, I it just came flying at the screen, that was pretty cool. Um, obviously, pretty cool. yeah, obviously, triggerable power ups uh, stack up to a limit. <gasps> you do get a limit on them. Oh, got power ups. Oh. Ten bloody seconds. Oh. Ten seconds for me bleeding life story. Uh, Bardicus, how many people are working on Carmageddon and Reincarnation now? It's about a team of about 50 people. Hey, Spurty. <laughs> Spurty, hi. Oh, it's Dargenator, oh. the, the hook on the car. Um, it can't be used to uh, tow other cars off the track. 
um, but it does. It can swing. It can. It, it's. It. It actually, you know, is a physics object in the. It'll twat heads around the head as you go past. If you get the swing, if the swing happens to be timed right, you can't control it at the moment. There's lots of discussion over whether or not you should actually be able to use, you know, flaps or whatever to uh, to control the swing. Um, Whee! Not sure. Not sure whether it'll whether that will happen or it will remain like other cars. Um, you know, basically constantly <coughs> moving things. Um, except with this one, it swings depending on the your movement because it's a physics thing. And uh, we quite like we just quite like the fun of it as it is. Uh, it's good that they're putting power ups in these sorts of places now, isn't it? Mm. A bit, little bit of work to get to them. Yeah. Um, so that there's a a random <coughs> element of whether or not it's going the right way when you um, come to you know pass a ped and you and you get a lucky twat on the back of the head of a ped. Um, and b um, I forgot what b is. Um, oh yeah, that it actually affects. It has a, an effect due to its physics. And it's mass yeah, I think on the handling of the car as well. We like both those things. Both of those things. Yeah. I think Valhalla's stuck in here. Oh, bitch. It's all coming down to China. <laughs> oh, yeah. What you got? <clears throat> it's got cows with these things on the reds. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but uh, what have you got in the way of. Have you got anything that can help Val get out of it? <laughs> oh, I love those cows with the. Has suit helmets on. They look a bit weird. That's I think so they should have stupid. bowls on the heads. Like a big, oh, yeah, like, like a, a yeah, goldfish like a bowl. bowl yeah. Because it looks yeah. like they've got a plastic bag on their head. <laughs> yeah. Sort of strangely kinky. It is. <laughs> oh, have they put like a. Oh, let's get out. See, everyone's got a view. Everyone's got a view. RPG Wizard. F she could lock. should lock the hook movement. Maybe it should. Maybe not. But um, yeah, maybe we could do something like that. In fact, we should be able to mod it so that you, uh, sorry, you should be able to mod it so it does whatever the heck you want it to. Who knows? <laughs> wow! I just, uh, went all the way out and, uh, and killed myself. That was sweet. Twisted mind, pets internal organs. Um, then they're, they're not intended to be placeholder, but um, they are sort of somewhat bright, shiny, and I think a little, you know, not, and also the scale seems a bit strange. The, the pair of lungs that come out seem to take up more than the whole of any body they come out of. Uh, stuff to be tweaked. Oh, I was in the back of it. <laughs> <laughs> Wheelman, obviously obsessed with wheels. Um, the ability of wheels to grip other vehicles. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I'm out. A, oh no, I'm back in. Wait, and you're being chased by all those curious cows. Yes, um, I'm out. Yeah, monster truck vehicles, <clears throat> wheels having grip that then pulls another car through under them. That's a very nice idea. Uh, in terms of physics, sh it should just work to you, but uh, maybe it's there's a limitation there. In the way that our um, sort of physics point object for wheels, and then having a special collision shape, possibly makes that something that's a bit beyond beyond the realms of what we can do with this game. <laughs> I do like a nice splatter bonus. Grave drinker, um, yeah. There's a lot. Still, lots of sound effects to come, um, and beefing up of you know, meaty old splatters against walls and stuff. Uh, we we all agree that there's stuff there that needs to be beefed oh. and improved. Look at where I've got my thing stuck. It was in there. Uh, yeah, yeah, um, your your question about the explosion sound specifically is is covered by that answer. Yes, the explosion <clears throat> sound needs to go in. Oh. Tipsy too, a car that's a giant wheel. Yeah, I think some other game did that. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Bardicus has answered the question. Darginator, yeah, uh, the muck and and uh, gore is going to accumulate on your car. 
Ruby. That's the guy in Castle. Hmm. <coughs> All the power ups, yeah. Huh? Yes. Bloody hell. Quite a lot around it. Yeah, they haven't. Um, they haven't skimmed on the power ups around this area. No. <laughs> Someone's gone fucking mad. Take some of these. <laughs> One of everything. And put them <laughs> where the other ones are. Yeah. Not. Okay, have fun selecting out of those. <laughs> I want that one in the middle. Maybe about 20 minutes. That's going to be a stretch goal or something. <laughs> yeah, I got one. Oh, oh, oh hello. hang on. That's uh, physics. Yeah, not quite working proper yet, is it? <laughs> it's like you get to the power of physics. Proper physics. Uh, yeah, I made it off. <laughs> Twisted mind. Intestines there. stuck in the eagle rear wing. Yeah, we've had these these discussions, obviously here, as you know, which won't surprise you about the idea of uh, um, yeah. strings of sausages of intestines dangling off of your car and all the rest of it. No, 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 I didn't <laughs> be, it. It'll be lovely. Um, whether we will get to that level of uh, gory detail, we'll we'll have to see. It's all ped stuff. Peds. 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 Um, yeah, RPG Wizard, again, going back to this uh, bloody swinging, um, <laughs> swinging hook. Uh, yeah, you, we, it would be, <sighs> it arguably be nice if you could lock it um, so that you can then dictate which side it is on. Um, but I'd still argue that, that, that it's, it's almost equally fun uh, to have the element of luck uh, and also to just try, as you're driving, to swing the tail out of the car a little bit uh, in order to get the, uh, the um, boom to swing uh, in a direction that then works out favourably from the point of view of killing pets. Good God, Bardicus. <sighs> um, I don't, well, all I can say is, uh, was Twisted Metal um, a sort of inspiration for Carmageddon? It came out after Carmageddon. <laughs> Just doing a grinding Tony Hawk's in. Oh yeah. <laughs> Tony Hawk's in style. Yeah, nice. Just yeah, doing yeah, a grind. Yeah. Should be going. That's rad. Oh dear, jelly suspension. It's probably not going to help me out there. Some like bombs to drop in. <laughs> we'll drop some mines down there. A jelly suspension almost adds something yeah. to it, the car that it lacks in its normal, you know, yeah. attitude. Uh, and as we were discussing earlier, I do think that there's a, an argument for making the cars a little, a little more loose on the suspension. It's, it's fun. Just to answer this question, well, first of all, yeah, there were there was GTA, Twisted Metal, Carmageddon. There was also Quarantine, I think it was called another game. There was a car type game that came out around about the same time that Carmageddon was coming out. None of those games I played. GTA, the original GTA, I played for about I don't know, maybe half an hour. It was a top-down uh, yeah, 2D I did game, that game, and um, I did, I, so it's for completely me, I did, different. Didn't, didn't really, and I didn't really like it. The original Twisted Metal, I did. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know you're again. You know, Sims Twisted Metal fan. Uh, the original Twisted Metal, I thought came well, out after Karma, the, even if it didn't. The original, I, I enjoyed. I've not, I've not really enjoyed the newer ones. To be, to be fair, uh -huh. um, I did. I did. I was a fan of the originals. Yeah, but in terms of what Whee! possibly was an influence, again, I, I would have played Twisted Metal for certainly less time than I played GTA. It was about ten minutes of driving a thing that seemed like a sort of hovercraft, had no physics Polypathy. at all. 
uh, and being constantly bombarded by ranged weapons that you had no idea where they were coming from. Oh look, they just um, appeared. Just muttering you constantly. Just didn't appeal to me. So that was that was the amount of influence that it had on me with I uh, zero. Cool. And they're different games, you know, completely different games. Yeah. Um, that all, that, yeah. all just, happily all live right. together yeah. um, and appeal to different people or appeal to the same, you know, to the, some people that like, like them all, some like one more than others. We all live happily together. Don't go down there, bear. Come this way. Oh, that should have been good. And just, I don't know, a postscript to that. I mean, I've played you know G GTA Five, completed the whole game, absolutely loved it. Put hours and hours and hours into it. It's also the first game that um, that my wife would happily sit and just watch me playing. Uh, she's never enjoyed video games. Um, GTA Five, she would watch it like we were like we were watching a film um, because it is such a, a fantastic experience. Um, I've played the entire game. Did it influence any ideas for Carmen Game? No, not at all. It's completely, it, to me, it's feels different. a totally different game. Um, and we can, again, you know, play games in which you drive in things and they just, they, it doesn't even cross your mind that it's something that, oh, we need to do this in Carmen Game. Mm. Um, it's different. So while I'm muttering about that, yeah. Oh, Interstate 76, again, another game. I thought the visual styling was nice, but I didn't didn't enjoy the gameplay of it. For me, it wasn't, you know, uh, it wasn't visceral enough and all that chasing around in the desert, shooting other cars in the distance, wasn't really, wasn't really a, a big, a big draw for me. No, Bardicus, I didn't think you were insinuating anything by suggest, you know, by asking the question. Um, about whether we were influenced and I, for God's sake I don't mean to sound defensive or anything if I do <coughs> uh, I'm just explaining explaining this, the situation like I say I didn't even remember whether, which game came out first but one thing that um, did it was <laughs> actually a heavy influence okay, I on Karma was um, Tetris funnily enough <laughs> so I, Ivan, <laughs> super stressful. Ivan, you poor bastard. <laughs> I did. I did a pelvic thrust, but to be honest, he had he had a quite a few bananas in that little circle thing <laughs> for quite a while. So, I. Yeah. No, the streets of Sim City. Yes, Errol. Errol's flummery saves model files now. Brilliant. Woo. We will be featuring uh, flummery in a forthcoming stream just so that we can <clears> go, <throat> look what this man has made it possible to do. Yeah. Thinking back, though, actually, to those early, early days um, of games, what were on the PC around around that time that we did play quite a lot. Of, uh, I recall things like Screamer and Screamer Two, uh, which were actually kind of racing rally type games. Um, that had a really nice uh, driving model uh, for the time and um, and were bloody good fun and actually got a lot of multiplayer play uh, in the office at the time. Hmm. Yeah, really triple. Since it's arena. Oh yeah. Cool. That's a bit different. Arcade game called Hard Driving. I'm not an arcade person, I'm afraid. I, uh, I used to go and watch my mates playing arcade games. Um, I never, I hated the idea of sticking money into a coin box constantly. Um, I was too tight-fisted. 
Yeah. <laughs> Touch later. That was, that was probably pretty window reflections. Oh, probably one so of those good. things that we, we looked at and thought, we need pretty window reflections in our game. <laughs> oh, we've got to work out a way that that can get right down that pressure. I guess if it's a big, big car. Look, he's stuck it. Yeah, that's oh, yeah. stuck under yeah. there. Yeah, so I'll toss him in there. <laughs> oh, he's well broke. Excellent. He's like flat as a pancake. He's literal pancake. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's so <laughs> pancake. Pancake is a bishop, so. Yeah. Oh. Now you see, Destruction Derby was a game that we mm. we hated because it stole our thunder, um, and because of our, our original demo uh, that got us the gig to do Pancakeism, um, that became Pancakeism was a 3D Destruction Derby that was at the demo that we made um, and it was shortly after we'd been walking that around published all the publishers that um, it was announced as a launch title for the PlayStation um, but not by us so, <laughs> so yeah so that's kind of hurts um, and of course it didn't do the physics anywhere what well, it didn't do physics because they were sensible and they concentrated on having a game that ran ran, ran really well on PlayStation, which uh, was quite important. Um, and, uh, yeah, and so in doing so, made a very, very good game indeed. I think I played that one. Yeah. Didn't mean my dad played that Yeah, yeah. Um, I said we were so bit bitter about the experience that we never played it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> uh, X Timmy, does the demo still exist? Do you know, I've... I've hunted around high and low for uh, the demo really only exists well it existed on it, we did it it was programmed on Mac um, and uh, we had a demo video of it I mean the, and God knows the actual Mac demo has long since disappeared and now it, it seems all the videos of it have as well unfortunately I mean, if, if we'd have got the gig to do, him in there. <laughs> yes! Yes! to do a Destruction Derby game for uh, the, the PlayStation, it, it would have been a, a massive exercise of frustration because of all the stuff with the physics that we wanted to do, that we could do on the PC, uh, we would never have been able to do that on the original PlayStation. Yes! Rectum! Oh, the rectum! All the rectums! See you, Grave Drinker. See you, Grave Drinker. Bye. Uh, Front J3, how long did we work on Karma 1? 15 months from um, from beginning of design to out, to the game out. Uh, eight of us working on it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good point, Mr. Lurid. Fire out of electric blue. <laughs> Doesn't make a lot of sense during Cock Rod. <laughs> Should have sparks coming out instead. Yeah. Like an overlord. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Conviction. I'm going to go on that again. Yeah. Got to be... And while we're re reminiscing about all these old driving games, even older than all of these ones that, that I've mentioned, was a game on the Mac, because me and Patrick started off making games for the Mac, um, and there was a game a, a very early 3D game called VET, as in Core VET, um, which was set in San Francisco and was one of the first times where you could actually just utterly tool around um, a city in a car and you could you could just drive as fast as you fucking possibly could into walls and stuff and smash your car up and uh, get, get chased by cops and all the rest of it. Pick up tickets for being a hooligan. Um, and that, if anything, <laughs> probably uh, in terms of influencing um, you know, the idea that we've got to make a video game where you can 
but you know, the object of the thing is to smash your car up. Uh, that was probably quite an interesting. Mm. Well. <laughs> oh god, I absolutely love that. I love that love game. Mega Drive was the. Uh, <laughs> it's an option. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's the only way you don't like. Change. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> I didn't even care if I won the race. Again, and yeah. then FMV bids, oh my god. Where, do you remember? Where they had the yeah, actual, the... real, at life actors in their uh, little videos. Oh and some of them. Do you remember when which if you won? What platform was that? Um, do you remember what you were playing that on? It must have been like. Oh, I don't know. No, I don't, I'm not sure. Must be a I mean, my memory of the, like yeah, because my memory of the Mega Drive one is extre extremely hazy, apart from the actual gameplay. It, the oh, honestly, they used to have chain twatting. They used dodgy. If you lost, yeah. if you lost, then everybody was like boo and everything. Yeah, 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 and then if you won, you got a girl on your yeah. bike. <laughs> used to oh, make yeah. me laugh. I love Rora. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It was a, a funny game. Yeah. And, uh, and it's things like that that the, the influence is. Yeah. It's got the humour on it, certainly. Yeah. <laughs> you could nick the chains off the policeman and buttons and stuff. Yeah. Um, but, right, Frontier 3, in, for me, getting into the video game industry was a complete mistake. It, it purely came out of moving back to the Isle of Wight to do freelance graphic design, uh, hooking up again with Patrick, and uh, becoming the um, artist on the games that he was working on, um, and that's how we started Stainless. How did you get into video games, Ian? <laughs> um, yeah, well, I don't know, I've just always been in some, I guess, and then I was studying um, graphic design at college and fine art, and then my tutor told me about a game design course, and I was like, oh, game design course, what is this? <laughs> so I went and studied about games, and then, yeah. So yeah. kind of like you, really. I probably yeah. would have ended up in graphic design if I didn't end up in the gaming industry. Yeah, exactly. But of course, you come from an era when there were actual courses. There were actual courses. To do yeah. With the well, this was. I think it was the third year or something. Yeah. I was in. Yeah, I think it was the third year that I just started it. So yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah but right. that's it. The inaugural days of uh, of courses in in it as a subject, which of course in my day. There, were, there was no such thing. You were either it's like a sort of computer scientist um, or a graphic designer, illustrator type of bod. Yeah. So that's... There you go. <laughs> there we go. A little bit of history. Uh, Twisted Mind, will we be able to get tyre punctures back? If we repair once we lost wheels. Do, uh, you, oh, uh, do you mean get t punctured tyres back on your car when you repair? Um, I think they'll, they're generally, the rule will be that they'll always be um, refilled with air when they're sucked back onto your, back onto your rim, darling. <laughs> um, yeah, the front J3, back on the history stuff. Uh, yeah, me and Patrick were at school together. So we're both from the island. Um, we were at high school together. I went right through high school together. Um, and uh, then I went off to work for, well, I went off to college and then work. So I was off the island for about eight years. Um, and then came back and hooked up with him again. And we got into, he was already into banger racing, got me into banger racing. Um, destruction Derby for those non-English chaps out there, and um, that was what we—that was kind of how we got back together socially. Yo, your Lord. See you, mate. See you, mate. Bye. <laughs> Cam getting to was the reason I almost moved into my friend's house. <laughs> I didn't have a good computer. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Nice. Yeah. Use your friend for their good computer. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, go! Look at we all end up in a little Because what's the funny thing, Project 3, where you say about the, you know, the demands that Carmel was making on the... Um, 
the harbour of the day in the same way that we seem to be doing exactly the same <laughs> thing now. We never learn. Um, and it was the fact that at the time that we were making it, even the PCs in our own office, the majority of them were struggling to play the game at a decent frame rate. Uh, so we knew what we were doing. Uh, we were really, <laughs> really pushing the, uh, the envelope. Grignard aircraft carrier map will be back. All the Karma 2 maps are being mod are being um, uh, reproduced by the modding community for us, as in the original maps, not remade, but just um, uh, modded into the game from the original games. Uh, so you will be able to see it that way. Um, whether somebody then decides, either if it's us or the community, to rebuild some of those other maps uh, is is yet to be. Yet to be decided because we haven't got a full um, idea yet of what yes. the DLC is going to be, uh, but there will be lots of it. Mind blowing. Oh, <laughs> bouncy, bouncy. <laughs> okay, Look at the mines. Ah! I'm so glad to die. Oh, nice squish. Just landed on that mine. <laughs> Bardicus. <laughs> yeah, you see, you guys. You were about <sighs> five when you first saw the game. It's funny, isn't it? I remember Patrick's children. They were they were about the same age. I remember them playtesting it for us. Uh, it hasn't done them any. Um, <clears throat> Micro machines, see another one. Micro machines, oh my god! We love that. That was such a good game. That's such fun. Yeah. That felt so nice. Yeah. I remember that feeling really nice. Yeah, yeah. And once you once you got I good at it, that's it was what we really, really enjoyed. Good. That's the thing. That's what makes the that's the kind of distinct distinctive thing about the games that that I remember from back then. They were ones that felt good. Re to, felt to play. really good. Yeah. Yeah. The, 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 and once the, you got like a really good actual, knack. Yeah. You mint out of it. Yeah. Yeah. It's good. I remember being pretty good at that game. Yeah, and of course it had the multiplayer aspect. Which was That's brilliant. it, yeah. I said anything we could all play together as like a family doing. Yeah. Racing against each other. All right. Yeah, check that. We've already, yeah, I've already said uh, today that yes, um, little comes to too tough. Way. <laughs> oh wow! It's all happening under there. Yes, you win. <laughs> Ten minutes to go. Was there a PC version of Micro Machines? Was it? I don't know, it's just that uh, um, Nathan Immortal has just said um, really oh, Micro Machines isn't on PC. GOG, so I'm not even sure if, it, if I was aware of one being on PC. I think that was another Mega Drive game for us. Uh, it's weird, unfortunately for me, I had, in like, because um, I had separate parents kind of thing, I had one called Soul and the other, you know, like make it, and it was kind of like rival wars all the time. So I had like, you know, what I mean, like Sega on one hand, Nintendo on the other. Yeah. So, so I genuinely get confused with what I played and what yeah, games and what platform. Which, yeah, what, what it was, what, what was on. Yeah. yeah. Obviously, yeah. apart from the obvious ones like Mario, well, that's obviously Nintendo. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, some of the later, yeah. Mortal Max has just said that like, Micro Machines version three was on PC. Yeah, I remember some of the later ones. But, right. But I, I, had, I got out of playing by then. The the fun with micro machines was purely multiplayer. Just yeah. four people on mega drives. Uh, oh, sorry, uh, Devin three. Um, my, um, will multiplayer have spectator mode? Um, I said I, I said it'd be nice if you could spectate in the pets, wouldn't it? So then you are yeah, actually. Yeah. 
Especially when you're dying <laughs> That'd and stuff. That'd be great, yeah. That'd be lovely. Yeah, it's got his pet if that pet. Away! <laughs> yeah, if that pet dies, you then. Repair in between pinballs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. You're only going to get hurt again. Oh, <laughs> cheap. <laughs> right. Ten minutes to kill everything. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Shouldn't be too far away now. Not very lasting, very long. No. <laughs> if any mortal, let's get this back on topic. Did we come to a consensus about that? Hook control? Well, oh, no, there, there isn't consensus at the moment because um, lots of people have lots of ideas about what should be done with the hook. Uh, my particular um, uh, thought. My favourite oh, idea is leave it as it bloody is because I like the fact um, that it does that it acts in a way that's affected that affects your power and also means that there's a certain random elephant to the chances of you hitting pets or not. Or you can introduce an element of skill by kind of kicking the car's tail uh, to swing the hook and catch a pet uh, with it. So. So I could say. I, I don't have any great compulsion to say, oh well, we need to change it from any of the suggestions <laughs> that I've heard so far. Pick it out, pick it out again. Don't shit has taken it right on the head. Who's that I've got a kill there? The other one. Yeah, who, who, who is, is that? that? Half a car. The twister? No. It, oh, it's it's a annihilator, isn't it? Is it? Thing. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh no, wait. No, is you're it, right, it's Twister. 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 <laughs> yeah, but is that bird that was in his car? Oh my. Oh my word, look at the cop. Oh, sweet. Sweet cop death. <laughs> well, RPG Wizard, uh, if you want the option to lock it, then. Well, it'll be in the. It'll be in the um, the stream suggestion list, and I'll raise it with with uh, design and with prod. But I can't make any guarantees, I'm afraid. Can a pet be a penguin with boobs? <laughs> yeah. I'll it first. Up to there. Ready? Oh, look at ah. that. Oh, nearly. Nearly. Yeah, nice. Oh, we've got a nice kill at the end. <laughs> what did that say? Minch meat. Yeah. <laughs> Minch meat. Oh, got a cop. Uh oh. Oh, uh -huh. really cool. <laughs> oh, he's going to drive himself under there, isn't he? To shit that's just reversed under the squash, I think. Oh, there's something under there that's keeping it from coming down enough. Oh, there it is, this little cunt. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> that's kind of random. I need to shout out to Sydney, Australia. Hey, Sydney, Australia. God bless you. Out there in the colonies. Hee. <laughs> <laughs> nice colonies. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. And oh. <laughs> <laughs> More opponent tosses. He's been honored as well, I've just noticed, I think. Oh! I'm thinking of the same guy. 
I the gun with the guy that has got the smiley face on his walkie-talkie. Yeah, yeah, the um, community uh, yeah. liaison twat. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it's got it's got quite a wide. No, actually, it looks like that. Yeah. It could be um, that dude from the office. It's got it's quite a marching. wide. Oh, is that you mean? Yeah, yeah. Right, right. No, 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 Steve. Oh, okay. Sorry. It's oh, are they, what the the other guy? The, the other guy. The, the stupid irritating. The stupid one. blonde irritating yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry. Yeah, because Steve Marsh is only in one episode of uh, the office. Right, where is this? All right, Trishina? come on. Where is he? Well, it's big finale time. Not you. Not you. There he is. Oh. <laughs> and toss and defeat. <laughs> Tossing ain't gonna do it. We need to get some speed. We not get any. Um, got anything else? Thrusties. Um, Thrusties. <laughs> I like it. It's a new name for it. <laughs> Actually, it sounds like something you get from Yeah. <laughs> thrusties. You've got a nasty case of thrusties. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 oh! Bouncy, bouncy. Oh, that's not going to help. Not for this long, it isn't. Don't mind a few seconds of bouncy, bouncy. Yeah, Benny Hill theme as a siren. That's a mod. Mod just asking to Oh, that was a good splat. Yes, aerial attack. He's after you. He's smashed into the. As he smashed into yeah. the sack. Oh, <laughs> I would have had him then. Yeah, um, twist of mind, being able to aggressively throw the hook one side or the other. Again, yes, that's something that we could do. And it's all over. Woo! Almost bang on time. That's another fantastic, Wonderful fantastic twitch. couple of hours spent in the company of our favourite oh. friends from the community. I'm Hooray! Uh, X to me, we would both love to do the me and Sim both do a version of the game, which is all sound effects made by us. <laughs> Great. Uh, so anyway, until next week. We we'll love be, you. We'll see you again. Uh, it's a goodbye from us here and at Karma Towers. Bye. Bye from us, Douglas, and the little ones. Little ones. We need to start a thread where we get them <laughs> named. Bye. See you guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.